All right, folks, welcome back with four of their first five starters from last season graduating. It wouldn't have been unreasonable for the Needham High girls basketball team to have lower expectations than last season where they reached the D1 South sectional final. Don't tell that to head coach Kim Benzen, though. Her Rockets still have senior forward Christine Ganzer, who scored her 1,000th career point as a junior last season. The girls opened the season with a 64-45 win over Braintree, and Ganzer led the way with 20 points. On Tuesday the 15th, the girls played the Dedham Marauders at the AGM, and they were looking for a repeat performance. We pick up the action. The girls basketball team in white hosting the, Dedham, the Dedham Marauders in maroon. First quarter, Colleen Rizzo back after missing the 08-09 season with knee surgery. She knocks down a pair of early jumpers and finished the night with 10 points. Freshman Maddie Ganser, she's going to knock down a three-pointer of her own. She is the younger sister of Katie and Christine, two Needham High greats. And speaking of Christine, the senior captain knocks down a three for herself, giving Needham a 12-5 lead. And here comes the defense from the Rockets on the Marauders. Danielle Salen steals the pass and lays in two of her nine points. And Dana DeChico inbound to Shannon Menchin, who makes a nice move and lays in the easy two as well. Second half, Rizzo with a nice dish to mention for the open jumper. And Christine Ganser knocks down another three. She would lead all scorers in this one with 20 points on the night. Needham wins this one 63 to 30 in blowout fashion. While the girls are away to Brookline and Wellesley next week, the boys open their basketball season with a buzzer beating victory at Dedham. Sean Collagen had a three-pointer with time expiring to give Needham a 46-43 victory. Kerry Hecker led the team with 18 points and 12 rebounds. They are 1-0 on the season and have their home opener on Friday the 18th against Brookline and then host Wellesley on Monday the 21st.